Hi viewers, welcome to mathematics class. The topic of, topic of our, our lesson is exponential equations part 3. In previous lessons uh, we discussed about the uh, exponential equations and what is the exponential equations and uh, also we uh, solve an example now for more practice i want to solve another example for you example solve the following solve the following exponential Solve the following exponential equation. Solve the following exponential equation. Four to the power of x minus 2 times the dot and also the arc and the cross all that have the meaning of multiplication multiplied or times same meaning 3 <coughs> the power of x minus 1 is equal to 3 now we can write this one just uh, in order to uh, keep all of the uh, anons to the left side and all of the uh, constant number to the right side or uh, we should uh, like separate to this one into two parts x to the power of x times 4 to the power of x times 4 to the power of minus 2 and also the next one is 3 to the power of x times 3 to the power of minus 1 is equal to 3 or 3 to the power of 1 any number that don't have any exponent or power means that it is the power of or the exponent of 1 now we can write this one x to the power of 4 to the power of sorry not x 4 to the power of x because it is this one have negative exponent or negative power we can write this into denominator like as a division 4 to the power of positive 2 when negative goes to the denominator from numerator the sign change from positive to negative or from negative to positive and times the second one 3 to the power of x over 3 to the power of positive become negative 1 and this is equal to 3 
or three to the power of one. Now the denominator of this one is one. Any number that don't have denominator, it is denominator is one. Now we do cross multiply. Multiply this side to this one, to this one. Four times three to the power of x because both of them are the same exponent or same power. So we can multiply these both together. Four times three is 12. 12 to the power of x is equal to, we multiply all of this together, 4 to the power of 2 times 3 to the power of 1 plus 1, 3 to the power of 2. In multiplication, we add the powers or the exponents. The power and the exponent have the same meaning. Now from here, we can write this one, 12 to the power of x is equal to, because both have the same power or the same exponent, we can write this one, we can multiply these, 4 times 3 is equal to 12 to the power of 2. The condition of that, we should uh, equalize the exponents to each other. The condition is that we should have the same basis. Because base of both of them is 12, now we can write the, the exponent of this one is equal to x. x is equal to 2. It means that it was a first order equation with one unknown and the solution is 2. I repeat for you exponent, exponential equations part 3 example solve the following exponential equation 4 to the power of x minus 2 times 3 to the power of x minus 1 is equal to 3. Now we can separate these two in the multiplication condition. 4 to the power of x times 4 to the power of negative 2. Again, if you multiply because the bases are same, we, uh, we can add these one and repeatedly it become again 4 to the power of x minus 2. The second one is 3 to the power of x times 3 to the power of negative 1 and that is equal to 3 or 3 to the power of 1. Now here it is 4 to the power of x over because if this is the have a negative sign we should make it reverse or bring it to the, the denominator. The positive negative become positive 4 to the power of positive 2 times 3 to the power of x over 4, 3 to the power of 1 is equal to 3, or 3 to the power of 1 over 1. Now we can cross multiply these two, because the exponent of both of them is x, now we can multiply these two. 4 times 3 is equal to 12 to the power of x. And this side, 4 to the power of 2 times 3 times 3 to the power of 1 is equal to 3 to the power of 2. This side, left side is 12 to the power of x, and the right side, because exponents are the power of both or 2, we can multiply these according to our previous lessons. 4 times 3 is equal to 12 to the power of 2, or 2. the power of positive 2 or the power of 2. Now, uh, the condition for equalizing or we can put the exponents equal to each other if the bases are equal. If the bases are not equal, you cannot put these equal to each other. Now both the bases are same among this base and this base, both are uh, 12. We can put exponents equal to each other. x is equal to 2. And x is equal to 2 is the solution for this problem. 
if we uh, plug the uh, x is equal to 2 here in these equations, the left side becomes equal to the right side. Thank you for watching our video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video with your family and friends and please press the notification bell to get notified for more videos. Have a great and wonderful day and nice. Bye bye.